Hey, shalom, brothers and sisters. Welcome back. I thank you again for joining me uh, today. I was just bored and I just wanted to uh, give some of my thoughts to you. Um, I was thinking about uh, the world, the world we live in, the wicked, evil world. It's uh, full of violence, confusion, stupidity, and uh, for a uh, a Christian or somebody in the assembly, this ain't our. This is not our home. We are ambassadors from the kingdom, and uh, you know, it just makes me wonder sometimes. I just think, and uh, you know, just pray, pray for the second coming, pray for the blessed hope, and uh, pray for uh, Messiah to come and create a real home for all of us, a real home, not just this confused demanding world where they you know they work you to death and you hear nothing but bad news on tv all the time or the lies or from politicians whatever and uh yeah it just got me thinking and i just wanted to uh just uh tell you that uh you know yeshua is coming back and he's gonna right some wrongs and it's about restoration and uh redemption uh it's like people ask me ask me in the past is uh the creator is he still creating did he cease from creating uh, is he still working or not and the answer is he's still working when it comes to creating it's more like this is a he's working but it's more of a redemption deal He's, he's, it's a redemption that he's working working on, and it's uh, the great master plan, and nothing could stop it. The devil, his angels, confused uh, evil humans, they can't stop it. It's going to happen, and uh, when the millennial reign comes, that's going to be a home like you, we've never had before. And uh, anyways, I want to read something real quick to you. you. You're probably familiar with this, a couple of these phrases, but... It's uh, from the author Charles Dickens, A Tale of Two Cities. I'm going to read a little bit here. Just It says here, it was the best of times. It was the worst of times. It was the age of wisdom. It was, it was the age of foolishness. It was the epoch of belief. It was the epoch of incredibility. It was the season of light. It was the season of darkness. It was the spring of hope. It was the winter of despair. We had everything before us. We had nothing before us. We were all going direct to heaven. We were all going direct the other way, directly the other way. Um, and um, anyways, uh, below this little thing here, it's from the Merriam-Webster Dictionary. Dystopia, dystopia means... Uh, Imagine world or society in which people lead wretched, dehumanized, fearful lives. That's a D Y S T O P I A. It's an imaginary world. Uh, but uh, the millennial reign is not going to be uh, an imaginary world. It's it's going to happen in the future. It's it's done set. It's set in stone. Done deal. It's going to happen, and uh, I can't wait for that. It's just kind of breaks my heart when I watch the news it's all about bad stuff evil wicked the lies uh, the violence everything it's, it's you know it's just not it's not it's it's not what is you know what we're all about not it's just not it's not what we're all about and uh, and I just look beyond beyond the storm there and I know there's going to going to be something better there's there's something better out there it's got to be and there is something better out there and uh in the meantime we still got to put up with this and live in this world only as ambassadors and uh conduct ourselves as Yeshua would conduct himself as the apostles uh as the body of Messiah the the assembly or we call the church but uh yeah it's uh it's something else it's just you know people being victimized and then 
or taken away from us or other families. And we don't, a lot of times we just don't uh, empathize with them and what it would feel like to lose a loved one prematurely by acts of other people's uh, defiled foolishness. And it is, it is awful. It's terrible. And uh, we got to keep praying, praying for a better world. You got to pray for the Messiah. We got to praise him, thank him and the father. We got to, we got the Holy Spirit to guide us. We've got prayer. We can pray any time for our, you know, petition uh, the Father. Uh, we can get close to him, ask for guidance, wisdom, understanding, and uh, help help out anybody we can, best that we can with what we have. And uh, it's going to get better. It's going to get better, probably not in this life, but in the next life is what some people would say. And Messiah, he's up there. He's working on us. He's working on a, on the plan. It's coming. And uh, I just want to be on the right side, the righteous side, the true side. And I do my best. And uh, it's all you've got, really. And uh, things are going to get pretty tough here, not just financially or materialistic, but spiritually it's really going to get bad. It's going to be confusion. It's going to get bad. And uh, either it's going to be the secular institutions or uh, some some diverted, perverted uh, faith type groups or organizations. They're going to be coming after us. They're going to be coming hard. You know, the, the secularists and atheists and those... Uh, Colleges and everything, academia, you know, they're coming after us, and uh, we got to be ready. We got to pray. We got to be ready because it is coming. It's going to be coming. It's doing it right now, but it's going to intensify. It's going to intensify, and uh, we got to be prepared for it. And the only way to be, pre be prepared for it is got to maintain our faith and uh, live a moral and ethical life, regardless of what what they do to us and it's going to get scary it's going to get scary but uh that's all i want to say about that and uh i thank you guys for listening to me i hope i didn't put you to sleep or bore you or anything and please don't give me no thumbs down <laughs> for this but uh anyways feel free to watch my other videos and uh comment below let me know what you think about what i'm saying and uh also give me a big thumbs up Hit that notification bell and uh, also subscribe. I really appreciate it. And I do thank you guys for watching my videos. It means a lot to me. Until we meet again, brothers and sisters, uh, peace out and shalom.